Hello there my fellow holotable heroes, let's play Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes. Now I'm back with another conquest video, already done, all the sectors, uh, feats as well, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, all the bosses in all the sectors, so interested in those guys, there will be a link in the description below to my Swagger for Life tool where you can see all of them very conveniently on a single page and just click through and watch the video that you want. However, in those initial guides uh, there were some of the sector feats that either I wasn't able to complete or I didn't yet find a great team to complete it, so this is kind of a follow-up video to address one of those feats. Namely, in this one uh, is the Frenzy uh, feat where you have to gain Frenzy 20 times. Now, initially I was using either Bosk or um, with Bounty Hunters or as well my Gear 8 based stun like with Ray Team or something. But best case scenario, in most cases I got one Frenzy, I think once I was able to get it twice. So definitely that feels like a lot of battles that I would need to do, I would probably be looking at about 15 battles or so, uh, which essentially is uh, a lot of crystals, because remember for each refresh you do get 6 battles, so I'm probably looking somewhere around 120-ish crystals, 125 crystals worth of battles to get that done. Now luckily here, in, at the end, before uh, Kenobi's uh, boss battle here in Sector 5, I finally came across the initial frenzy consumable. Now normally I don't really promote buying consumables because in most cases you don't really need them and they're not really worth it. However, this one could be worth it. So that's why I'm making this video so you can make a decision if it's worth for you or not. It costs 75 crystals and what allows you is that uh, at the start of battle all allies gain frenzy for two turns and so that's basically for two battles uh, that allows you to do that. Um, so for 75 crystals, let's give it a go, see how this all works, because remember, to just do it with pure battles, you're probably looking at a cost about 125, maybe even 150 crystals. Uh, so definitely this looks like maybe a half price kind of a deal for that feat, uh, if you are spending crystals uh, here for buying energy anyway. So let's just go ahead, purchase this uh, consumable here for 75 crystals, and then we're going to equip it and see... Uh, how this actually works. Um, so just uh, showing you consumables, now it's showing there that I purchased it. So just tap it, yes I want to use it and then it will get equipped for the next two battles. So that's how straightforward it is. That's why I'm showing you this because I've never used a consumable so I just wanted to also show you in video how this looks like in case you haven't used consumables before. And I'll just find an opponent that we want to go up against um, here. Um, all Night Sisters. Uh, Asash can dispel, that's why I don't want to go versus Night Sisters. B2 can dispel. I don't want that they dispel my frenzy. Uh, so I'm just trying to find a team that does not have a dispel here. Um, again, they got Asash there. Oh man, it's hard to find the team here. But anyway, let's see. Try versus this one. Uh, I'm just doing the, my, my Old Republic here feat, uh, I think, that's why I just put Jedi here. Alright, here we go, so there we go, everybody start off with Frenzy. Uh, so now every time I use a special ability, everybody get full turn meter. That's why I brought in Rey, because obviously she will be faster than Asajj there. So she can get Lifeblood out, give turn meter to all my allies. And now we're just taking unlimited turns, <laughs> basically, because everybody have Frenzy. Uh, so this battle is straightforward obviously now from here on out going after Sash first so she doesn't dispel my frenzy I mean for the feat itself I don't think it would really matter whether they dispel frenzy or not I just thought like do you know what if I spend 75 crystals for frenzy I want to be able to keep it uh, throughout the battle uh, so you go after two turns frenzy will expire so Revan's out already Hermit Yoda's out of frenzy so is Ray. Um, also Bastila now probably uh, we lose as well, Frenzy here, and get a stun on Juku, yep, so he does not counter attack. There he goes, thanks to Zeal Zealous Ambition Disc, both <laughs> there, Jolie and Bastila doing a lot of damage, uh, even on their basic attacks. Um, if I swap their meter here, Duke obviously will counter attack, yeah, but you know, I think I can take a counter attack from Duku here, there we go. Alright, call Julie for an assist, <laughs> and down goes Dooku. Uh, just probably have to take now Newt down twice, and then what should just disappear from the battle anyway. 
Um, so from, you know, the way you understand this, I gained Frenzy here, right, five times. So which means, from that point of view, to gain Frenzy, um, like 20 times that feats requires, it means uh, because each consumable gives you two uses, so basically from each consumable you, you should get out 10 Frenzies, which means you would have to buy two consumables, but I could only find one. And if you buy two, then the cost is the same as uh, refreshing crystals. However, as you will see, I was able to get all 20 Frenzies done in a single battle, uh, which is a bit confusing to me. Uh, because consumable, there it said, you get Frenzy at the start of the battle. So I had five characters, each of them gets Frenzy, that means I got Frenzy five times. So why did this count as 20? I don't know. Is this working as intended or not? I'm not sure. But at this point, if this is the case, that it does get you Frenzy 20 times in a single battle, then I definitely think it's worth spending 75 crystals on this. However, if this is not working as intended and it will get patched in the future conquest updates, uh, then that it will only count, uh, you know, that you got five uh, frenzy five times, not 20. So if that happens, then maybe it wouldn't be worth any more uh, buying consumable. But for now, in this current conquest, unless it gets fixed in the next one, you know, if you do come across this uh, frenzy consumable, it's definitely worth, in my opinion, spending 75 crystals so you can quickly and easily knock out this frenzy feed here in sector 3. Alright guys, hope you found this video useful and helpful. Let me know in the comments below or on my Discord server. But until then, have fun, enjoy life, and may the RNG be with you my friends.